state, ain't that what they call it? Bypass went flashing. Feel like we don't gotta go inside the agriculture station. You never get a bypass on that thing. Let's see if we get a bypass on the weight station. Look at that line of trucks. Reminds me of down in Laredo when you come to those uh, immigration checkpoints. People ask you, they be like, are you American? But it's, keep in mind, the, the uh, immigration agents, most of them are Spanish. But they're asking you, are you American? I never forget, back in the day, my old trainer, who was coming through when I was at Milton, they asked the question. When my trainer said, are you? <laughs> hey, the guy just gave us a funny look and, wait, and told us to keep going. That was so funny, man. He, it was an ice cold grill, too. He was, hey, he was pissed off. I said, we're gonna get the bypass on the weight station. Hey, back when COVID first hit, the state of Florida Welcome Center, Every, every car had to pull in. Trucks could bypass, but every car had to pull in, like a like four wheelers. All the commercial vehicles kept going. Hey, we're all way from Disney World. If anybody thinks I'm in Orlando, we got a good little ways to get to Disney World. At least another three or four hours to get to Orlando. We're going to Jacksonville. I got 23 miles to my destination. Like I gotta go across the scale. Normally don't have to cross the scale coming in Florida. They got a lot of trucks pulled in today. And they're trying to make some of that COVID money back. They're trying to make some money off of inflation. They're gonna get it from the truckers.
Hey, my total weight on this load I got is 61.95. So I'm definitely not overweight. 61.95. Green light, baby. Green light. Definitely not overweight. We out of here. 20 miles to go. Blue truck turning yeah, that right now. Right, we have blue truck turning down, and there's gonna be another road right on your right that'll bring you up the back of this job site. Right, right. Yeah. Gotcha.
big ass loop, get in there. Yeah. Or you can go up to the end of this road, turn around, it's a lot easier to get in. It's up to you, because last one, if you don't make the right turn over there, your ass gonna get something bigger than shit, I had to pull you out. Gotcha. But if you go up and turn around, you can kind of just come at a straighter angle in. So go down, turn around, and come right yeah, back that's up. Yeah, a couple of them did. Just go down towards the end, it's over down there, they turn it around. Gotcha. It'd be a lot easier on you, I promise. Okay, I'll turn around. And I'll be here waiting on you. Okay. Go down and turn around. Shouldn't be too hard. I could have turned around in that warehouse right there. A lot of warehouses I could have turned around at. Next warehouse I see, I'm turning around. Turn around. I know these people are like, what are these guys doing in my damn yard? I tell you what, boy, it's hot down here in Florida. These people don't want me to turn around on their property. Oh yeah, oh yeah, baby. We in there. In there like swim wet. Hey, between me and y'all, I feel like I could have made that right turn. I could have made it. You said the last truck got stuck. I think I could have made it. Look, now that truck is pulling out. The same truck that was blocking the road, he pulling out now. So I could have waited a few minutes. Where's he at? He told me he's standing there waiting on me. Oh, there he is. They have train coming. Fuck. Where 
Where's the damn train at? There it is. Following me long enough to know I'm a pretty good driver. Y'all should know this by now. Send that depart, uh, the arriving cosign e message because we're moving at a pretty fast pace. But I'm just calling to let you know I'm here. All right. skills are. We're backing up out this thing. camera is not going in reverse I'm actually backing up and it's backing around I'm backing around a curve
almost out. Oh uh, yeah, just send, just send it to me, and I'll uh, I look I look at all three of them, and, I, and then I let I let you know. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I, yeah. I look at him and let you know. All right. All right. Thank you. Woo! That was eventful. I just got stuck again just now. You heard me on the phone. That was my dispatcher sending me some load offers. What she got? I gotta find somewhere to pull over and look at them. Two ninety five is right up here. I'm gonna take me back to ninety five. Hello. ever get tired of y'all ever get tired of hearing me say oh it's been a while since I've been here last time I was here I know I say that quite often but I really just be telling the truth this is Statesboro Georgia guess what been a while since I've been here at least a year Claude Howard Lumber. That's where we headed to. I think that's how you say it. Claude Howard Lumber. Of course, it's going to Madison, Virginia. Y'all know about that place. Right outside. 
South Center River Avenue. Hey, they got a college up here. There it is right there, Georgia Southern. I know it was some kind of college in Statesboro. Everybody likes to go to. They have a lot of parties out here. From what I heard, I don't know for sure. I've never been. Georgia Southern University. I see these cars itching to jump out. It's itching to jump out. Turn right at the traffic light. Turn right at the traffic light. I gotta go wide on this one. But this Jeep is too far over. Look at this Jeep. Look at this Jeep. Over the line. In one quarter mile, turn right on Stillwell Street. Come on, college kids. Too far over the line. school they would have told you to stop at the light and wait for the next light so technically that's what I should have done but sometimes you gotta force your hand just make them back up right on Stillwell Street we gotta make another sharp right turn right here Real sharp. Real sharp. In one quarter mile, turn right on Park Avenue. Here we go. that train right there that's why we don't stop on the train tracks you never right know where the train is at
Hey, keep it between the muscle and the mayonnaise. Keep it between the muscle and the mayonnaise. I'm going to a job site. Second job One site this mile. week. Turn left on the drive southwest, then take the first right. Hoping ain't too hard to get up in here. Downtown Winston Salem. Might not be too hard. I only gotta make a left, then it's supposed to be on my right. Friday, gang. It's Friday. One more load and we headed to the house. I got to get home a little earlier today so I can try on my suit I got for my baby shower next Friday. It was next Saturday. Baby shower next Saturday. Baby Nevada. Get home today. Give me a haircut. Cause tomorrow I'm going to Charlotte to hang out with my buddy. Cause my birthday is next Tuesday. So I'm gonna do a little partying this weekend. Oh, I looks like I see the apartments up there that they're building. I can see them from here. And that's where I'm going to some uh apartments. I see them already. Right up this hill. You know what? When I get up here, I'm gonna pull over to the side. Let's we'll see where they want me to where they wanna unload me at. Before I pull up in there. Like some pretty cool apartments. Oh yeah. Hey, this might be the last time y'all see me with this Ram and Nelly headset on. I got an email last week from Blue Tiger. They sent me two headsets in the mail. I got them at the house right now. So when I get home today, I'm gonna check them out. I just partnered up with Blue Tiger. 
They sent me two of them, and they gave me a discount code to share with y'all to save 10% off. Y'all remember a couple weeks ago, I made that video about that Bluetooth scanner for a car. I got another scanner at the house too. This time, I got one for a truck. Two new sponsors. Hey, flatbed pays off. And my YouTube channel, of course. <laughs> Thanks for watching, man. Let me pour this tarp off. before you just pull in. Like the load I just did in Jacksonville, Florida. I called the guy on the phone when I was like 15 minutes away. And I asked him, I said, hey, is there anything I need to know specific about the job site? And he was like, yeah, when you get here, do not pull in. Pull over to the side for my man to come out and get you. creeper because my trailer got to clear these trucks. Woo! I'm creeping. 
Yeah, that guy said, don't pull in. He, he made that very clear. Because the entrance that, that the address took me to was actually uh, like where they had the office buildings at for the, for the place. Now I'm in a dilemma right here. I want to go left. My GPS ain't, it ain't routing me in here. Turn right on uh, Green Street Southwest. I'm saying no truck route. Turn left on Melrose Street Southwest, then keep right. So it's catching up now. I'm gonna turn left on Melrose Street. It doesn't look like a truck route. So we gotta be very careful. Basically, I just got to spin the block, get back out. So I need to go real wide right here. So I don't knock this damn stop sign over. Keep right to Cloverdale Avenue Southwest, then take the second left. Woo! So once we make this right down here, we should be back on the same road that brought me in here. That wasn't too hard. Hey, don't fall for my exaggerations. Don't fall for my exaggerations. This is an easy job site. But some job sites can be, they can be pretty dangerous. It's all about communication. And it's all about leaving yourself for out. Just like they teach you in the Smith system. Leave yourself for out. But just back there when I made that left out of that job site, if need be, I could have went straight back, if need be. It was a straight road. I could have went straight back. So here we are. So we're gonna get back on uh, I-40 right up here. And we're gonna ride I-40 all the way to my favorite place to go on a Friday. Dudley, North Carolina. My favorite place on a Friday. Because those loads, I can always get a load out of Dudley going to Wilmington. So that means I can be home early on a Friday and I don't have to leave on uh, Sunday. I can leave Monday morning. I leave Monday morning about, I always try to get up as early as possible. But if I stay up late and I'm a little tired, I don't, it's not a big deal. I don't have to rush. Especially with some uh, AFC, NFC Championship this weekend. Turn left at the traffic light. Hey, my picks for this weekend are Cincinnati and San Francisco. Those are my weekend picks. Oh, so I'm supposed to make this left right here. Oh, that's the freeway right here. Doesn't look like the freeway. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna make this left. Get back on I-40. South 421. I'll be in Dudley by two o'clock. Go to Dudley, pick it up. It's a preload, of course. So I should be home no later than 4.30. Good timing. I'll be going to the barbershop today. I ain't gonna wait till tomorrow, I'm going today. Shouldn't be too many kids in there. You know, Friday, kids get out of school. First thing they wanna do is go to the barbershop. I used to be the same way. Barber shop. Let's get it, gang. Hey, where y'all Dudley boys at? Got a couple loads out here for you. I couldn't have Dudley more than my own downtown. 
Hey, nothing to see here, folks. We're gonna go ahead and wrap this one up, man. Flatbed gang, big snow. <laughs>